Hey guys, it's Garrett Stewart with Keller Williams and Command Console, and you are a referral partner for the Reno Sparks in Northern Nevada area. Uh, I'm really excited. I want to show you off uh, a new uh, update to your Command app that you can utilize for Family Reunion, Mega Camp, or any other Keller Williams event where you're meeting other agents and want to utilize the QR code that's in there and add them straight into your contacts from Command. So this is a new update that just uh, today, I'm filming of February 12th, uh, just rolled out in the last couple of days. Uh, and I wanted to really show you how it functions and not just how it functions, but a way to really strategize around it to make sure that you're utilizing it to the best potential. So let's dive in and see how you can scan another agent's QR code. They can scan your QR code uh, from the command app, enter it into command and send them a text and email immediately. So let's let's take a look at that so first thing you're going to want to do is make sure your marketing profile is all set up in your command settings that's the biggest thing which you just can go to settings and go to uh, and go into down here on the settings over here to my heads in the way that's why uh, down to connect settings to uh, update your marketing profile if you haven't already that's where this information feeds from from your QR code just FYI uh, from there uh, for the follow-up system we're gonna want to make sure we have a tag set up for uh, this so you can go right into contact tags and get a new tag right there uh, and so I had already created one uh, called KW uh, KWFR 24 test so I just created that uh, for the example so you can just hit create tag type in what you want something really easy to remember uh, and type out so that way you can add these tags uh, in to trigger the follow-up so enter that in pick a color and then you have create then you're set there now you're gonna want to create a smart plan and the reason for that is uh, when you scan an agent's QR code at family reunion using the command app this is going to automatically start a follow-up system. Uh, so my suggestions with a follow-up system are this. Make sure there's value. It's not just spammy. We're all realtors. We know how command works. We know that stuff is all automated for us. So make sure whatever we're sending is clear, concise, and not just uh, salesy blasting people. Uh, I, I hope that you respect people and other agents that they don't want to just be getting a bunch of texts and emails from you. You got referrals from me here, got referrals from me there. So uh, make sure, and this is why I was purposeful on uh, my follow-up system for this. I created an email and text, basically sending them my contact information and service area. That way they know and can reach out to me. And then I set up a follow-up after a few days and that's just a task for me and I can kind of designate from there how they should be followed up with. Uh, so that way you're not just, it's not a blanket covering everyone of doing that. So if I want to choose a different follow-up system uh, at this point, I could assign them to it there, but at least I have that task to remind me to do that uh, later on. So this is what I did. I created a smart plan. It just said, great to connect with you. Would love to be your referral partner for the Reno, Nevada area. And I have my contact information there. At the same time, I have an email. Uh, thanks for connecting. And I actually asked a question. I'm looking for a response. Uh, and I said, uh, please share all the areas you serve. Mine are Reno, Sparks, Carson City, and Lake Tahoe areas of Nevada. Um, and then got my information there at the bottom perfect so we've got that done now you see i'm in my command app over here i just have that sharing uh during my screen share uh and so what we're going to do is we're going to open the command app and we've got it right here and if you don't know you have your qr code that fills from your marketing profile you hit their picture right up there and you see the my business card right there this part isn't new, um, but you can click on it. It has your QR code. This is a QR code that's going to, if someone scans it from their camera, which is what we've done before, it just goes to save it as a contact in their um, in their contacts applet or co yeah, in the contacts of their phone, not command. Uh, but now we can actually save it in command automatically. So what we're going to do is, whoops, I'll exit out of there. And there is, you see the three dots in, in and I'm in contacts here. Uh, you can see here at the bottom. Uh, at the top right, you see those three dots. I'll hit those three dots and we now have an add with QR code. If you don't see this, your app has not updated yet. Go to your app store and make sure you update the app. Uh, from there, you can hit add with QR code. And I'll pull up my, 
I have a picture of mine, so this will make it a little bit easier. Uh, add with QR code, and you'll see I'm scanning it right there. And just like that, it goes and fills in. So from there, you can see my info, my email, my phone number automatically filled in there. And uh, uh, I can add additional information. Even my social media information is all on here as well. So very cool way to, you know, it even has my work info and all that good stuff. So this is a great way to do this. Uh, but if I were to just hit the save button now, I'm never gonna, <laughs> I have a couple thousand contacts in my command. I'm not gonna be able to follow up with them. So what am I gonna do uh, is I'm going to tag this to help me find it easier. So uh, we talked about having that tag created ahead of time. And uh, I think I scrolled past the tag. Oh yeah, it's right there at the top. Add, remove tag, make it easy. And I can just search KWFR 24 test. So I had that created and so I can just select that and hit save. And then um, now this, uh, I'm gonna go back to the smart plan I set up here. What you need to do when you're creating a smart plan is you add a tag trigger. So with a tag trigger, continue. Uh, with it, you'll see this add trigger tags at the top. So with that, it will hit add tag trigger and um, or trigger tags, and we can type in that. Um, there we go, KWFR test. Uh, for some reason, it doesn't let you create the tag. I learned uh, when filming this video, practicing for this video, I learned you can't create the tag on this. So we create the tag ahead of time, and then that way we can select it there, and we can hit add trigger. Now. Um, you can hit save plan and now it's going to be a live uh, smart plan for you that you can add people onto. But uh, the great thing about this, instead of having to manually add them onto the smart plan, when I add and going over to my command app over here, um, I've done this before going to Family Reunion. Now, when I go to add that person, I scan their QR code at Family Reunion, this will all populate on here. And, uh, and so when I hit save for this contact, whoops, uh, it's automatically going to send them, uh, send them a text and email. So I'll go ahead and hit save. And yeah, boom. Oh, and now I'm already a contact in command, so it won't let me save it. But what's gonna happen is it'll automatically save it and, uh, and be able to send it off from there. And so they'll get a Twilio text from me immediately, should. Uh, as well as the email with my contact information. So that way they have it no matter what and I can follow up later. So before you go to Family Reunion, build out your smart plan. Have a uh, you know have a tag trigger so it's easy while we're out in the go, we're meeting someone, we scan their QR code and this is only applicable for the command app codes. Uh, it's gonna feed in that way. This is not for if you're using a third party QR code uh, site like Blink. Um, I think there's Link. <laughs> uh, there's a couple of those out there. This will not work for those. This will only be for if you're utilizing this through the command app, at least to my understanding. Uh, so be sure uh, if agents are using that, you can put this QR code on your lock screen if you want to. That way people can scan you easily. Uh, and, and you can share it back and forth. So that's my suggestion. You just have to just have your command app ready to go for that QR code scanner. And just so you remember where that's at, uh, you just go to the contacts part, hit the three dots at the top and hit add with QR code. So super cool way to add contacts uh, uh, right from your command QR code. I hope you guys enjoy. Again, I am your referral partner for Reno, Nevada and all the surrounding areas of Carson City, uh, Sparks and so on. Uh, my information actually is right here. You all can also watch my command training videos. I have a website commandconsult.com. You can select videos and see my other video trainings here all around command and other agent training stuff. So thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you at Family Reunion.